Atlanta is a mecca for wealthy African Americans. Who are these women? I mean, mm -mm. <laughs> let's get another chair over here. Yeah, we got room. Portia, well, I'm really glad to see you. I'm glad to see I'm you. I'm happy as well. that you're here. Marlo was just telling us that you said you didn't want to be in any bad energy, and uh, this event is not about that. So when you say his image was tainted, what are you referring to? You know exactly what she's referring to. That sounds like I sign on to be your beard, basically. Whatever happened between Cordell and Portia, it is nobody's business, especially not manless Kenya's. Kenya would be willing to sport a beard, a goatee, hair on her legs, hair anywhere she could get it if she could land a man. Do you think you can pick me up and take me over there? I'm a, like a buck fifty. You okay with that? I'm good. Okay. I, I can handle you. Okay. Right. You ready? Okay. Oh. <laughs> you look like you're struggling a little bit. Oh, no. I'm good. Hun, the way you're wearing that dress. Damn. <laughs> uh, yeah, pretty hot and tempting. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. What's the strangest place you have, son? <coughs> Uh-oh. I think you're a little naughty. Oh. Yeah, I do. Walter, it's like, we talked about three days ago. It was beautiful. We, we even talked about eloping, how it would be really easy and simple for us. While we're here, you know, you seem really open to the idea. I never said that. I said I wasn't opposed to eloping. That didn't mean it's going to be tomorrow. It didn't mean anything else. And look, I'm not going to let you or anybody pressure me into eloping or getting married. I'm not going to go into a marriage thinking, oh, you're Why pressuring me. Are you yelling? I am not yelling. I'm making sure you hear me. Are you hearing me? Because if you didn't hear me the other day, it's you don't cool. want... It's cool? It's cool. It's cool. Walter. Okay, I'm, then. I'm good. No, it's your tone. And oh, now it's my tone. tone. Like, okay. Done. Sweet oh, Thank you. Talking to me any old kind of way. This is not mine. Who's in here? It's got to be the landlord's. Kanye's wedding dress. <laughs> this is crazy. Let's have a wedding. This is ultimate payback. This dress looked like a throwback from 1970s. I mean, are we talking about Alexis Carrington from Dynasty? That's straight out of like Disney Snow White, baby. A lot of people say yes to the dress. When she saw that dress, she should have said, oh, hell no. That's beautiful. Hell no to the dress, Kanye. Hell no to the dress. Why would she leave her wedding stuff here? No, the bigger question is, why would you put it on? Oh my God, because. You tried to get me out, <laughs> and I'm still here. <laughs> you tried to throw me out. See what? You tried to throw me out. Say, huh? You tried to throw me out. Come on now, break but it. I'm still here. Still here, come on. I'm still here. Still here, come on. I'm still here. Come on, come on. I'm still here. Give it to me now, break I'm it. Still break here. it, break it, break it, break I'm it, still break here. it, break it. It's <laughs> very emotionally disturbed. Pardon me, can I please speak with you? I'm not gonna degrade you. I wanna just apologize for some things. Can I speak to you in private, please? I promise you I'm not on the Well, board. the last time I saw you in Mexico. Listen, we're not going to Mexico. This is yeah, a new but, day. But your wife asked Listen, that... it doesn't matter. My wife is not in this equation right now. This is all I wanted to say. Look, I apologize if I've ever offended you. I apologize if I made you feel less of a woman. The reason why I wanted to apologize is because I'm about to go to prison. I just didn't want to leave knowing that I could have possibly hurt someone, and that's just not me. That's not who I am as a person. But the issue that I have with you, Apollo, is the fact that you lied on me. You Listen, went around telling people that I saw you in L.A. Listen, you had your wife telling I'm people this story. I'm not going into this again. I offered you an apology. I said I apologize. I should not have told my wife that you offered me fellatio. What? Apollo is apologizing for lying about this whole fellatio business. 
Am I hearing this right? I shouldn't have did that. You should okay, not that, have that was, lied that was and said that, that I line. saw you in that's L.A. because I have but never seen you in you, L.A. I'm not going through everything okay, then, just tick for tat. No, this, I'm is just saying, this is crazy. Because you can make it be about anything of how it's specific. What you are saying is bull. I apologize to you. What, my, my apology Long is Long feel better about it. My apology is bull. Unless you're sitting here saying can I you, apologize that's for bull that's the only, only thing I want to do is apologize to you if I made you feel less than a woman. That's it. If you don't I'm accept sorry, it, I don't I give a hear. damn at this point. Clearly. If you want to continue to be rude and be an ass about it, yeah, like, well, literally, like, literally, I mean, you can't even okay, see my not, eyes. Not, like, not, you, not, go, Paul, it's just like you not. continue to be fake. I don't think he I've had a lot of practice. I think he's been working on that. Yes, he was doing the socks with flip flops. Don't talk about my favorite son. That's my baby. Okay. His mother just read me. I have officially been read by somebody's mother. Is anybody up disappointed in the size of their waffle? This is not Waffle House. <laughs> exactly. yeah. That road trip was pretty rough. So what was it, seven hours? Yeah. It turned into like eight. Matt knows I just really don't like to drive. We keep talking about what Kenya doesn't like, but what does Matt dislike? Uh-oh. Well, Some don't things know. don't need to be said. <laughs> Please the this, son. Please the this. Kenya, what are your intents for my baby? <laughs> Go ahead, Kari Michael, to know. I don't want anything else from him other than to wipe the slate clean and be friends again. I felt like, like with most people that I've had conversations with, it's been consistently about what Kenya wants and Matt, what you're doing wrong. What about the things that you've done wrong? You see? Hold on, just give me one second. No, I, I wanna, I wanna. We didn't come here to talk, talk about that? each other's problems. Because it's not about your flaws. That's not what I'm here for. That's not what I'm here for. Uh... Besides, can you hear us? Oh, okay. Hello, in the flesh. I want to also thank my loving husband. Here he is. My knight in shiny armor. Well, he has definitely improved since being a cardboard in San Francisco. I don't know if he's her real husband, but he's real. Look how pretty those pancakes are. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And you doubted who? Mm-hmm. We are Grubhub champions, just so you know. That's not true. We're uh, uh, getting the treatment today. Yes. You gonna put her in here? <laughs> hmm? Yeah. All right, let's get a chief. Yeah. Here Come you on. go, baby. Okay. Okay. All right, we gotta do it. We gotta, we gotta hold hands. Thank you, Father God, for allowing us to have this meal with our family, for always protecting us. We ask you, Jehovah, for you to repair any broken hearts in our family. I just want to tell you, you know, when you, you brought me out to Texas, I know I ran away. But the fact that we didn't talk for years, really hurt me because I needed you when I was a teenager. And I know I caused you a lot of pain, but that was painful for me, too, to lose you for that period of time. I was just a kid, and I was only thinking about myself. I didn't like the neighborhood. I didn't like any of the people, and I didn't like my school. So I ran away all the way back to Detroit. You talking about pain. You don't, you cannot imagine that pain. I felt like, hey man, I failed. You know, I finally got all my kids and hey man, we all gonna come up together as a, as a tree. And when you decided that, hey man, Texas ain't it, it's like, hey man, I don't want my daddy. He ain't made it good enough. He's not good enough. Well. Don't nobody want to be told they not good enough. Ooh, wow. Wow. French roll for the Kayla. Don't do that. Take a number. Everybody tell what they said, so I can read everybody oh, one by saying? one. You gotta learn how to read first. So, bitch, you're the reader. Yeah, I'm not the reader. But, bitch, I go don't below the belt. Don't hurt me, Milo. Well, you said I can't read. Girl, save your money.
ready for a new FedEx label to ship your used clothes to eBay. LeBay by Marlo. I'm here for you, from Dior to Chanel. I wrote a lot of dicks for these pieces. It's not a bad idea, actually. <laughs>